Hi guys, welcome back to the channel and another vlog. I am currently walking surf riddles off after a very quick jump session and a quick canter up the hill because we are going eventing tomorrow. Um, we're off to Chillum Castle, unaffiliated. Uh, we're just doing the B, we're not doing the B80, we're doing the unaffiliated 80. Um, just hoping for a really fun run. No expectations. I would love a clear round cross country. Don't care about time, whatever, as long as he's happy and forward. Um, obviously I'd love a clear show jump in, but again, as long as he does nothing silly, I will be happy. And I would really like an under 35 dressage because we all know he can do it. Oh look, here's Robbie. I don't know if you can see him. He's coming to meet us. <laughs> so yeah, I'm uh, gonna spend the rest of today getting Fred ready and chilling with Robbie. <laughs> uh, unfortunately, Robbie won't be there tomorrow, so you won't get any of his uh, humour, so you'll have to make do with him plodding around the farm today. So what? No one gets your humour. Well, I do. Otherwise, there'd be not much point in us with that. <laughs> anyway, uh, <laughs> he's creasing up. Look at his little face. <laughs> <laughs> right, I will catch you in the morning. We've got an early start. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna go get ready and then have a nice afternoon. See you later. Right guys, it is 7.30 on Saturday evening. You can't really see behind me, but everything is packed. I'm pretty sure I've got everything ready to go, uh, except the fact that I forgot to wash Fred's cross country boots from last time. So I'm just heading home to do that now. Um, but yeah, apart from that, all ready to go. I think we're heading off about six in the morning, so I'll get here for five. Uh, trek down to the other end of the farm to get him, and we should be ready to go fairly quickly. Um, I've already platted him, I've just got to roll them up and then get the trailer, and we will be on our way. So I'm just getting to oh dear, the top of the driveway, so I better stop vlogging and I'll catch you. Not very bright, but early in the morning. Bye. Morning guys. So it is, oh, you can't even see me. It's 10 past five in the morning. I've just fed the yard and now I am going to go and get Fred. Um, I've got a trek all the way to the other side of the farm in the dark and I forgot my equi light, which is not as good, but never mind. We can do it. I'll, uh, See you in a bit. Okie dokie guys, so you definitely can't see me now because I can just see the light tinge from uh, the town behind me. However, I have found Freddy and we're heading back to the yard. Um, I could have put him in a closer field last night, but he would have been on his own. And as he has a history of ulcers, I didn't want to change his routine or anything. So here we are. Um, I'll let you go because it's pitch black um, and I'll catch you in the daylight. We have arrived finally. It's daylight. I am here with mum that you've met before on the vlog and Kev, who's not paying attention at all. Good work. Good work. <laughs> Kevin, You're say hi to the vlog. Hello. Hello. So it depends on how these two video as to what you guys will see today who knows could be anything are you gonna be good at videoing yeah oh, that's all right then you heard it first hand everybody I got um wet feet you got wet feet already brilliant um we are just gonna go walk the cross country walk the show jumping uh get ready and head off to dressage catch you in a bit
so the cross country course is walked um everything looks quite nice um there lo there's loads of space between the fences um he's actually jumped everything in a combination of the 90 and the 100 when we came and did the 90 in april so quite happy just gotta keep my leg on and keep going and we are just about to go and get ready for dressage and it started pouring yay never mind um yeah let's get ready and go so we are ready for dressage uh, we started up in the pouring rain but it seems to have taken pity on us and has stopped so as usual i am running late so i'm gonna head over and see you in the warm-up <laughs> Okay, so Daniel was um, reported into the steward and he's now warming up.
dressage is done. Um, really, really happy with the warm up. He was really soft and bendy and just felt like he was at home, um, which is probably the first time he's ever done that on grass. Went into the test and he did have a little wobble, um, grabbed hold of the bit and stuck his head up in the air like he does. But he did actually settle this time, which is nice. Um, we didn't have a repeat of Blindly Heath, where we had rodeos and most of the test was quite good. Um, there are a few bits, like right at the beginning, um, when he broke the canter that I really didn't like um, and a few bits that I really did like. So overall, could have been a hell of a lot worse. And the main thing is he's calm and he walked back to the trailer on a long rain and didn't jog once. So, so far we are winning. Good boy. Good boy. There's a uh, granddad Kevin looking after Freddles while me and mum went and walked the cross country course. Happy. Smile. <laughs> <laughs> Comedian. Right, let's go get ready for show jumping. I have had a quick look at the course. Um, it's all quite plain, there's no fillers, etc. Not that Fred minds fillers at all. Um, the ground, as always at Chillum, is quite undulating, so that'll be a bit of a challenge. But it's all quite small, quite quiet. Um, yeah, looking forward to it. Let's see how it goes. Okay, now we're in the jumping warm up. Pretty boy. Yeah. What are you going over there for? Good boy. What are you going over there for? Doing your slappers on there. There you go, Fred. <laughs> well done. Where's you going, Fred? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. What a chill pulse. Okay, now we're in the warm up for the cross country. So definitely. It's 
looking good. She's talking to him all the way around, bless her. Go, Danielle! <laughs> Yay! Oh, that was so much fun. I think we may have conquered our cross country demons. Um, he was very, very lucky and nappy up to about fence five. Um, it's definitely the judge's cars. So he kind of comes along and goes, whoa! But a little tap down his shoulder and he actually just looked at the fence and went which is really lovely because I could not get any sense out of him last time. Um, clear, and I think we're inside the time. I was chasing the last few because I know he'd run for home and he got a bit excited, but I don't think we went too quick because I was slow to the first few where he was a bit silly. Um, but no, I can't really ask for much more than that. He was absolutely game on after the water. He did stop at the water, but it was about eight, st eight strides out looking at the judge. Um, but I kept him straight, so I'm hoping they shouldn't count that because it was so far off. Um, and the little boat before the water, straight in the actual water, no worries. You do like water, don't you? But no, he was epic. And I didn't update you guys after the show jump in because I had to get Fred ready, but he jumped to clear around. Um, a little bit feisty, but nothing like he used to be. Um, and he's been really, really good in all of the warm ups. So it doesn't matter where we come, what the dress size score is. I'm very happy. Really glad we came. Good boy. Right, let's go get this pony washed off and get his cold boots on. Fred, come here. No, this <laughs> he says he doesn't no, want to be in the video. No, this way. Fred, Fred. He's, He's way hiding. <laughs> okay, guys, so the results are in. We have managed a sixth. Yay! Yay! I'm really, really happy. The only slight downside is sack the jockey because she went too fast. Whoopsie. So we ended up with four time penalties, which is very annoying because I had my watch on. I was listening to the beeps and I thought I was in the time. So I kicked him on and he absolutely flew through the finish line. Uh, but yeah, I cost myself fourth place. But he's Skills. So can't help it. Yeah, as Mum and Kev keep pointing out, he is an ex-racer, so he's rather speedy. Uh, but the jockey should be less silly and pay more attention to the watch. But never mind. Um, the dressage was 35.3, which I feel was probably really fair. I've not seen the sheet yet, um, but some of it was really lovely and some was a bit babyish and wobbly. Um, so yeah, positive score. Really, really good day. I am a buzzing. Let's see what the family am think. How do we feel about today? Well, too well. Well, considering we got up at five, I think he did really well. Yes. <laughs> got I'm awake four. now. Oh, well done. I'm not. <laughs> Don't think so, the camera. before I close the vlog, I'm just going to say thank you very much okay. to my top grooms for the day. <laughs> and thank you, Freddie, for being a good boy and not being horrid to me. <laughs> so, yeah, really, really good day. Massively pleased. Super glad I came. Um, and if you guys want to see more fun with Freddles, subscribe to the channel and I'll see you again really soon. Thanks for watching. Bye. Say bye. <laughs> Thank you.